All right, I found this cute little hatchling skink when I was uh, repotting some of my carnivorous plants. Hmm, yes. He's a real, real beauty though. He's got red on the front, all the way down blue to the back. No, you don't. There's his color. Boom! He's on fire! Wish I had racing stripes. That'd be sweet! All right, little buddy, back out to the garden with you. See how tiny he is? Oh, them is my queens. That's cool. This is not a worm. This is a snake. It's called a flower pot snake. It literally just came out of a flower pot. It's a good day for things coming out of flower pots, apparently. There it is. That's this tiny little face. There's his tongue, oh, it's so cute! Little tiny tongue. These guys' eyes are completely, are nearly completely dissolved. They just have little eye spots. And he was just poking me with the tip of his tail. I don't know if that's some kind of defense. It's amazing. Something this small can live. Also, I was uh, repotting all of my little pitcher plant clones. They're doing so well. Look at all those fun, fun little pitchers. They're going to be up for sale soon. So my first attempt at Nepenthes propagation was an outstanding success. All right, I'm gonna see what other animals are inside this box before I throw it away. Okay, here we have side by side the worm snake and an actual earthworm. This is the earthworm over here. And this guy is the snake. Watch how they react when you touch them. Watch what this guy does when I touch him. same writhing chaotic motion that you see earthworms do all the time. It feels like, oh, there it goes. <laughs> I think he's actually attacking my hand right now. He seems to be digging this uh, sharpened tip he's got on the on the end of his tail into my finger. It is a little tender, but I mean, it doesn't really hurt. I imagine if it had uh, some kind of really small, soft-bodied creature, it could actually do some damage. That's an interesting, interesting technique, young grasshopper. Ah. His scales are just so tiny and so smooth. It really feels almost slimy. He's just using that pointy tail to move himself along there. These guys are awesome. I only ever find them by accident. Because we were lucky today. Oh, look, my earthworm is climbing out too. They're so hard to pick up, just like an earthworm.
There's that pointy tip. He keeps trying to stab me with. I'll stab you with my tail. I'll kill you. I am so tiny, but I will kill you. I don't think so, bud. You're pretty cute. All right. So that's pretty cool. A couple of uh, cool random finds today, just because I was doing some transplanting on my some of my plants. That baby skink and this cool guy. All right. Thanks for watching. Thank mm -hmm. you.